So when we look at the peripheral nervous system, we talked about the afferent division and the efferent division. Now the afferent division is what comes into the body from the environment. Our body picks that up through receptors and then interprets that information and then effects change in the world. So the efferent nervous system is divided into two major parts. One of them is the somatic nervous system and the other one is the autonomic nervous system. Now, the somatic nervous system is really where the skeletal muscles move. Skeletal muscles, see I'm moving, they're attached to the skeleton, they're attached to the bones, and they are voluntary. I can move my head around um, as much as I want. Um, sometimes I do it involuntarily. Uh, but, you know, if I <laughs> want to make a point, but for the most part, we can move our muscles, these muscles attached to our skeleton. And what happens is in the um, somatic nervous system, so let's say we had a run, that would be the somatic nervous system telling our leg muscles to run. Uh, my class doesn't have to know about the neuromuscular junction or um, myosin, tropomyosin, actin, any of that stuff. Um, but. I may cover that in a, a future video here on YouTube. Um, the other half is the autonomic nervous system. Now, when you think autonomic, one, one thing you can use in your head is automatic, but automatic has two settings. One is fight or flight, and one is relaxation response. Now, it's not really automatic. It's your brain uh, interpreted information, and then uh, there is a reaction. But the autonomic nervous system has two major divisions. One is the sympathetic and the other is the parasympathetic. I'm going to go into that in detail in another uh, video because uh, we get into the language, but the sympathetic nervous system is the fight or flight reaction. That's when you're in distress. When you see a bear and I don't know, in, in the guidebooks they say if you see a bear hold your hands over your head like this, you know, but I, I don't think that's going to help. Um, so do you just stand there and get scared of the bear or do you run? I, I don't know. Don't go out in the woods. That's the answer. Don't No going in the woods for you. But um, the other one is the parasympathetic nervous system and that is the relaxation response. The parasympathetic nervous system is the relaxation response. Okay, we'll talk about that all in another video. Take care, bye.